Hey everybody, this is a different video than I usually do. And I know some of you are probably gonna like this and some of you may not like it, but I received a box of goodies from a dear friend of mine who visited Sedona, Arizona. And if you don't know, Sed Sedona, Arizona is a place where there's a lot of really positive energy. They have like four different vortexes that create like a big vortex. Anyway, she went there uh, on a vacation and I, so I'm just gonna move the microphone in so you guys can hear me. Anyway, she was so thoughtful. We were talking on the phone and I was saying that I wish that I could have been there with her to experience it with her. And she was so thoughtful, she bought me a bunch of little gifts. And I just wanted to share with you guys the stuff that she sent me. I just thought this would be kind of a fun, spiritual haul. <laughs> anyway, guys, um, so I'm just going to grab stuff out of the box and show you little by little. The first thing she got me, honestly, this is my favorite thing. I absolutely love this. And this is a little uh, Indian medicine bag, and it has these stones in it. And I haven't opened it yet because... I just love the way it looks on this card and I'm afraid that if I open it, I'm not sure if the stones can actually go in that bag and if they do, are they gonna fall out? I'm just I'm scared, you guys, and I feel like it looks so perfect as is. I cannot read what that's, I'm gonna try to read it to you guys. Okay, medicine bags. The Native American people, yeah, I can't do this. It's, I'm not able to read this, sorry guys. It's too, I, I don't know if you can even read it because of let me see if I can get this up there for you because of the fact that it's wrapped in plastic. It may not happen. Basically, it's about Native American medicine bags, and these are supposed to be good luck. You're supposed to carry them with you, and it's supposed to be something that gives you, like, good fortune, prolongs your life. It's just really sweet. So that was that. I wish that I had my friend here because she could read everything for me. So here is this other thing that she got me, and I am super excited about this because I just have a very strong affinity for the chakras and the chakra systems, and I'm naturally drawn and attracted to anything related to chakras. Um, and this is a beautiful candle that has all the chakra colors here. And by the way, if you're interested in purchasing a chakra bracelet, I will have a link to my shop where you can do so. I sell these really amazing chakra bracelets. Um, but this has all the colors going from the root all the way to the crown. And I just think it's really pretty. I'm just going to smell it. It doesn't have a smell. It doesn't smell like anything. But it is made out of palm oil, which I've never had a palm oil candle before. But I just think it's really cute. And I'm going to put this. I'm probably never going to burn it, you guys. <laughs> um, but I'm going to put it like in my background for when I do like face videos. This will be something pretty in the background. I just I was super excited when she gave that to me. So put that on the side. I'm digging into my bag of tricks. She gave me this too. And I think that this is absolutely adorable. It's this really cute little, it looks almost like a Christmas ornament, but I think it would also look pretty hanging on a porch where you can kind of see it glistening in the sun. So I think it would look pretty on that too. And this is called a, oh, this the name of the store is Dos Damas Designs. Uh, let me see if I can. I'm going to definitely try to find a link if they have an online store. I'm going to see if I can find a link to it so I can like share it below. But this is just a cute little little native guy. He's so cute. He's got a little feather in his hand. I just think he's really sweet. And he has such good energy. Like he's really, really just, I feel like he's celebrating. Full of life. So let's see what else we have in the bag of tricks. Oh, this is really cool, you guys. She got me a dream catcher. And I don't think I've ever had a dream catcher before. I may have years and years ago, but definitely not in my recent time. And I think that this is just a, such a cute little thing. It's so pretty. I love this little stone right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. Let me get it in frame. But it's got this gorgeous like webbing and it's so pretty and these little feathers. I just think it's really, really pretty. So that, she got me so much stuff. <laughs> I was not expecting this. This is probably one of my favorite things. I know I said I love the candle and the candle is definitely one of my favorites. But I love this too, just for what it is. This is a little, I'm wanting to say this is an ornament because it has a string. And it's representational of the adobe houses, and it's made out of the same clay. And I'm just trying to see. It says, yeah, ancient adobes. Uh, I can't read it. I'm going to see if I can get it up there for you guys. Sorry, uh, legally blind problems. 
there we go. I don't know if you guys will be able to read it. I'm going to, um, there you go. So hopefully you can read it. You can pause it. But it's just a little adobe, and it's got this cute little, like, plants painted in there. And I just think it's really, really cute. I love it. I love the way it feels, too. Oh, this is cute. This is just a little mini rug. It's like a real rug, but it's just tiny. And I just thought that this was adorable. I have to find a purpose for this. I don't know if I'm going to keep crystals on it or if I'm going to keep the candle on it. It kind of looks good with the candle on it. Let me just do it like this for you guys so you can get a little sense of it. But I'm not sure what I'm going to keep on it, but it's very cute. I'm going to find a purpose for it. I love little mini things. I kind of wish I had a dollhouse. <laughs> and the last thing... Let me just make sure. Oh, no, no, no. Sorry. Okay, the next thing that uh, she got me, and I love this. This is a cute little magnet with the cactuses on it from Arizona. It's just a magnet, but it's so cute. I love this picture, and I'm definitely going to put this on my fridge. You can always use another magnet, but I love it. There's a vintage -y kind of look to it. I like it. And then this is the last thing. She got me some actual dirt from Sedona, Arizona, and this is from the base of one of the mountains. She didn't climb the mountains because she was not able to that day because um, she was not dressed properly for it, but she got as close as she could to the bottom and she scooped up dirt and she sent it to me and I thought that was so sweet. It says 428 2019 Sedona soil from the base of Cathedral Rock and she wrote that on here for me, which I think is really, really nice. But this is just actual dirt from Sedona. I'm going to just put some in my hands, you guys, so you can kind of get a look of it outside the bag. It's, like, very hard. Like, it, it's very hard. It gets, like, um, chunky, I guess you could say. But there you go. That's dirt from Arizona. And it's definitely got a very positive energy vibe. Um, I do, I do want to do something with this dirt because I think this was – hold on. Let me just put this back without making a mess. Ooh, I made a mess. Yikes. Okay, get the dirt back in there. All right. Can't get this dirty. All right, so I do want to find a way to uh, display this in a very nice way. So I'm probably going to get some kind of a small um, bottle, like a perfume bottle or something. I don't know what I'll use, but I'll, I'll do something to display the dirt. And you guys will probably see this at some point in my background of my videos. So that's, that's a thing. But... <laughs> I just wanted to, you know, celebrate this, you know, beautiful energy of Sedona. But anyway, guys, this is definitely a different video than I usually do. I know it's a little bit off. So if you like this video and you enjoyed this little haul, then definitely comment below. Let me know what you thought. Let me know what your favorite item was. Let me know what you really felt. If, Like I said, if I can find a a link to the store or any of their web pages or anything I will definitely put all that information below so you guys can go shop there yourselves if you saw anything you really liked uh, and that's pretty much it I hope you guys have a wonderful marvelous amazing stupendous day we're up to like 454 subscribers that's great you guys are killing it you're doing such a good job I'm trying to get to a thousand so I appreciate all your help and if you want to subscribe and like this video and comment that would be amazing if you stayed all the way to the end of this video then I want you to comment with your favorite flavor of ice cream all right guys I hope you have a great day and I will see you in the next video I just want to take a moment to remind you guys that if you wanted to purchase a private reading from me, all you need to do is click one of the links below and it will take you to my website or my Etsy shop. Also on my Etsy shop are some products with my art on them. So if you're just interested in perusing them, you can check it out. Ooh, look at the nice readings I got. Also, if you're looking for a fun way to spice up your Instagram feed, you can follow me at Psychic Jennifer Moran. I post often and I think you guys would really enjoy it.